Today is April 22nd, 2020, day 16 of Singapore's Circuit Breaker. Yesterday, Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong announced that the Circuit Breaker will be extended by four weeks till June the 1st. Additional measures will be implemented immediately to stop the virus from spreading. From now till May 4th, shops that sell mainly drinks, snacks, cakes, ice cream, desserts, and also hairdressers and barbers are to shut down. F&B outlets that sell meals at hawker centres, food courts, and coffee shops will be allowed to continue delivery and takeaway services. Opticians can only operate by appointment. Pet supplies and retail laundry services are permitted to only provide online sales and delivery. Four popular wet markets have new entry restrictions. NRIC or FIN number is required. Those ending with odd numbers can only enter the market on odd days. Those with even numbers can only enter on even days. This restriction may be extended to other wet markets if needed. If you need to go out to buy food, to buy groceries, go out alone. Don't turn this occasion for a family outing. And if you need to go out for exercise, exercise alone and in your neighbourhood. And now for the latest data. I will let the figures speak for themselves. Nineteen of the 43 dormitories are gazetted as isolation areas. Foreign workers in essential services have been moved out from the dormitories. All foreign workers in non-essential services are to suspend work until May 4th. All movement in and out of dormitories are to stop immediately. That's all for now. I'll be taking a break and I'll update again when there's new developments. Thank you for watching.